add in, exploding to Zakan right there. Once I've settled, that's gonna be much easier. So Asmut, and then we have Yudmila, double buff. Oh my god, okay, that was enough. Hey, what is up guys? Gitarok here, welcome back to another Brave 9 video. Alright, so let's go. We're gonna do some Guild Wars. So this is like my first official, or is it second, since after the Octo update. So we're fighting Exodus this week. So it's going to be pretty challenging. We have Vetriel right here. Okay, I'm guessing Lucius plus 15. Mm, not going to be fun. Nice runes though, crit damage, crit rate, lots of good runes. Uh, plus 10 Velfren with 2 vital, of course this is a good one for Velfren. Oh I didn't know that it's better to go with 1 flat and 1 percentage, or is it just he's trying things out. Livia is plus 15 as well. Okay, uh, not going to be fun. Definitely not something that you can, you know, just expect to win. How about this one? There's a Yuri. There's a Lucius plus 15, again, very... A lot of challenges right here, alright, it's not going to be easy. Uh, Livia, I do think that this is this is doable. You can actually use... I think you can use uh, Veronia with Lyudmila. I'm not 100% sure. So that is one option that I can think of. But I'm going to guess it's Grand first. In that case, it's not going to be easy. Let's see. Lyudmila Alec Okay This one might actually be doable But of course I'll have to see at the At who is going first on the team But I'm actually Yeah, based on all of this that I've seen I think this one might be the easier one At least for me, right? Because I don't have much units that I can counter Okay, the Livia is plus 12 But I think I have a slight idea on how I can deal with her Alright, let's go. Okay, so I have something set up against CDFH, CDFH. I'm not entirely sure if this will work uh, smoothly, but we're gonna try. So enemy will have Refitia to Livia with saw that there's a Glacier going first. So I'm gonna set up something like a Helga right there, right? So something like this, Glacier hits me. So in this case, Helga will basically just uh, activate buff prohibition on everyone. So the objective right here, notice I'm not using any taunts, right? The whole goal right here is to try to use, to not use any taunts so that I can uh, not mess anything up. So in this case, after Helga dies my turn, I will go with 1, 2, 3, as mode take care of Lyudmila. And then for, hopefully Dalvi can take care of Livia. I've seen Dalvi consistently deal with Livia plus 12, so it shouldn't be a problem. The only problem is gonna, let's see. Alec coming in later. I do have uh, Zakan. Yeah, I don't think there's anything that I need to worry about. Takes care of Rafitia. Uh, Adin will get stunned, so I don't have to worry about Rafitia. My Rafitia dying. So far, I s don't see how this can be can screw up or can be really bad. Alright, this is a Lucius plus 12 though. So I sort of have to be careful with that as well. Uh, first time fighting Lucius plus 12 here. Let's go. Okay, so we're gonna see first. So enemy will go in with Glacia, like I mentioned. So buff prohibition activated. So we will go in with Asmut to Dalvi. Okay, so far so good. Alec power, kaboom! Okay, so that will stun the add-in. So that's the entire objective. I know Christina is not doing much there. Like, it doesn't make sense what is Christina doing, right? Uh, the objective right there is just because Lucius is there. I want to get rid of Lucius later on. So that's the only thing uh, that my mindset has for the time being. So Livia first. So in this case, uh, Adin still stun. Right? Okay. And then my Lyudmila goes in. I think we got this. Yeah, that's why I have Christina right there. Because round 3 or whatever this round is, Hopefully Christina can constantly bombard the Lucius with multiple, multiple hits. Yeah, that's, that's the objective right there. That is the objective. GG. 
Okay, the Dalvi hitting Livia part, that was a Livia plus 12. I'm not sure if Dalvi can still consistently kill a Livia at plus 15. Maybe it's going to be similar to Grant's case where you have to double buff for Dalvi. I have yet to encounter those, but GG for our first match. <laughs> first OP Octo match right there. Let's go. Okay, so next up, um, let's see. I think I'm going to try to attack number 8. Number 8. Mirai X, X Mirai X. So, very scary. We have a bunch of, uh, actually, no new Octos right here, except for Beliaf is plus 10. We have uh, Livia at plus 12. Okay, so something that I could try to do. The only problem is Livia. I don't think I can use Dalvi because there's uh, Albion right there. It's going to be very annoying. So, a couple of things that I could try, and I sort of have an idea. So, let's give it a shot. Okay, so after looking at the third order and everything, this is what I came up with. I'm not entirely sure if this is will work. Uh, I'm still very, I wouldn't say 100% confident in dealing with all the new meta Octos. Livia is plus 12 right here. So, enemy will go first with Livia to Beliaf, Beliaf to Albion, Albion to, let's see, Albion charge up, and then 4, Rafitia, Velta, Yuri. So I do have my Livia position right there. So Yuri hit my Livia, and I will have that Helga die alongside with her. And then my turn, I will go with 1, Livia, 2, 3. I feel like I want to go with Michaela to Yuri. So that will get rid of Albion. And then we can hit Lucius as well. Hopefully that's enough to get rid of Lucius entirely. And then when it's his turn again, so after 6, Grant will go... Um, I think Valter will still have the turn priority. So I'm going to go in with my Ventana. So I'm not sure plus 6 Ventana with 3 buffs is enough because I will have Helga buff. Rafitia buff, Michaela's buff. Although Nullifier is there, so only Michaela's buff will be intact. Because Velter has Nullifier, right? Reflective Nullifier. Mm, yeah, this is going to be kind of annoying, so I'm not sure. Not sure if that's, that will work out. We're gonna see. It will either hit Velter or Grant. One of those two. And then I will go with 6 later on. Uh, let me see. Do I go with 6 though at this point? Like, do I go with Dalvi? Because I feel like maybe I should just go with a Lyudmila. I'm not entirely sure. Will Dalvi be back in human form? Okay, I think we can stick with Dalvi so that Dalvi will hit Grand later on. I think that's the plan. Yeah, skeletons though. The skeletons, that might be a thing. Okay, so at the end of the day, Adin will end up hitting my Zakan. So that's the objective. I will not use any taunt, so my Lucius is right here. Protect against Livia, enemy Valter will hit my Dalvi. Hopefully she gets charm in the process. So, based on my calculation, that's what I can see. The furthest I can see into the future is right there. So, let's see if the strat works. Ah, please don't screw up, man. Okay, so we have taunt everywhere with Albion. So Yuri going first, so that will activate Helga's uh, taunt. I mean Helga's buff, sorry. And then we're going to go in with triple buff Yuri. Smack that Lucius. Nice. So Grand going in. Ventana. Okay, we have a skeleton. Nice, Ventana can get rid of Velter. Dalvi! Oh my god! I forgot to calculate that. She was back in human form. Just in time. Okay, it doesn't matter because... I will have my... Livia getting rid of that. Okay, plenty of skeletons but... Okay, will this screw up anything? Let me see, let me see. Uh, we still have you reverse. Uh-huh, uh-huh, okay. Okay, uh... I need my Livia, sort of. I need my Livia. But there's no Thorn. It's kind of scary right now. Okay, we're gonna constantly smack the Livia. Okay. Dalvi, man. If only Dalvi was alive. So Ventana cannot do anything because mine is not... Okay. Boom. Okay, uh, we still won. Dude, am I actually getting one star? Oh my god, I'm actually... <laughs> oh, I'm getting one star. Yo, what? Yo, that was bad. Okay. Just because my Dalvi died right there. Okay, everything just turned downhill from there. Oof. Wow, that was the worst one I've ever done, ever. Like, holy moly. I couldn't have, yeah, I couldn't have done anything better right there because if Dalby goes 
later. Uh, if Dalvi goes earlier, she would hit Val Valter. So I was aiming for that Dalvi to get rid of Grand. Everything goes according to plan except for that part. Would Lyudmila would have been better though? Like I'm trying to figure out, would Lyudmila have been a better choice right there? That was really bad. That was really bad. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, so moving on to the next one. Uh, still adjusting to the meta. Okay, so next up I'm going to attack White Berry. So this is what the enemy has. We have one, two, Okay, so three mages at the back. So that's very tempting. I'm going to go try my luck with um, Veronia to Lyudmila. So this is a plus 15 Livia. So this is my first testing uh, to try out this method. So I'm not sure if that would be possible. I do think Veronia to Lyudmila can actually take care of Livia. And this Livia does have Rafitia's buff. So I think this is an ideal standard. So we can actually find out here if this is enough. Alright, so one, two, three, four. Velfen there as well. So Adin is the first to go, I have Zakan set up right there. And then it's my turn, I go in with 1, 2, um, when I go Asmode here just to take care of this Christina which is next to the Lucius, that's my objective right there. And then we go with Veronia to Lyudmila, boom. Okay, I think that's about everything that makes sense. So yeah, let's try it out. So Velfern right there can be a little bit scary. Uh, let's see. If Livia doesn't die, it's going to be really hard, but I do have Grand for round 2, in case, you know? Just for the taunt, uh, for the sake of taunting her away. So let's see if this is enough. Oh my god, triple mages! Here comes Adin, exploding to Zakan right there. Once I've settled, that's going to be much easier. So Asmut, and then we have Lyudmila, double buff. Oh my god, okay, that was enough. That was enough. Lyudmila's buff with Rafitia, still intact. And of course, Veronia buff. Was enough to take care of a plus 15 Livia. So that Livia does have about 10k HP, I think I saw. About 10k HP. So hopefully that's a good enough indication. Or benchmark for you guys to try and use as well. So yeah, GG. I think everything goes according to plan from this point onwards. Uh... Yeah, so for those of you who wa who wonders if Lyudmila can take care of Livia, uh, yes. So that wasn't Livia main target, that was a Livia side target, you guys saw it there. Uh, Natus was the main target, so Livia was secondary target alongside with Valfren. Okay, now that Livia has, let's see, about 10,000 HP, which is quite high I think. Usually the standard I see is 9.4 or 9.6k, this is like 10.1k. Okay, very good runes. So yeah, this is a very high standard Livia, so hopefully you guys can gauge for yourself the benchmark of how Lyudmila can deal with Livia in the future if you guys plan to use. Uh, but make sure Veronia is a must, alright? I don't think because Livia does have this stats weakening right here. So if you want to use Vero uh, Lyudmila, make sure you have Veronia's buff, alright? Stats weakening is very important. Maybe Stella might work as well, anyone with stats weakening, but Veronia does give Lyudmila insane buffs. So that's the benefit right there. Alright guys, so that's gonna be it for this video. Hope you enjoyed it. And if you do, subscribe, give this video a like, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Have a nice day. Goodbye.